Now, your weather alert forecast. Good morning, everyone. I'm 3 News Now, meteorologist Mark Stitz. Excessive heat warning will go into effect early this afternoon, and that continues through Friday night. Due to the potential for the heat index, which is the combination of the heat and the humidity, climbing to over 110 degrees at times through those afternoon hours. So again, dangerous heat. Take it easy outside if you do have to be out there. If not, enjoy some time in the air conditioning and take it easy. As we go into the Wednesday morning commute, though, very mild to even start things off. Temperature is near 80 degrees, plenty of sunshine and then through the rest of the day that gets us to 90 just for the lunch hour. Then actual temperatures will push into the upper 90s this afternoon. As we go into the early nighttime hours, a few hit and miss showers and thunderstorms will push in. Those will not be for everyone, though. And it looks like those will end early in the night. And then as we go into your Thursday morning commute, we are dry. Once again, temperatures during the day in the upper 70s to low 80s across the area. So very mild start to the morning, not giving us much relief from this heat. So this afternoon we're going to be breezy in that wind going to pump in the heat and the humidity from the south. Temperatures top out near 98 degrees with mostly sunny skies. Early tonight then a few hit and miss showers and thunderstorms push through, but again the rain not going to be for everyone. Lows only near 79 for your Thursday morning. Thursday afternoon the heat continues. Highs near 99 and we will keep it breezy. And then Friday temperatures top out near 100, but again the humidity going to make it feel like it's over 110 over the next few afternoons. Saturday the heat starts to back off just a little bit, dropping back down into the upper 90s. We'll have to dodge a few scattered showers and thunderstorms heading into Saturday night. Some of those could linger into Sunday morning, but Sunday afternoon looking dry and we continue to cool off little by little highs and low 90s. Hopefully we can drop back down into the 80s early next week.